Hello, sports fans and football fans out there. Got another game for you. And uh, we are going to do today a classic um, uh, Big Ten matchup. And that is going to be the 2022 Indiana Hoosiers at the 2022 uh, Illinois University of Illinois. <laughs> I forget offhand what they're called. But anyway, we will launch the game. And I'm going to receive the kickoff. I want to receive the kickoff. Fighting Illini, that's what they are. The Illinois Fighting Illini. So we are going to return the ball. I mean, we're at the three-yard line, so I'm not going to take the ball at the three. That's for sure. And we get it out to the 22-yard line, it looks like. So, um, the offense for our Illinois team is going to be wide receiver Casey Washington, split end Brian Hightower. At left tackle will be Julian Pearl. Left guard will be Isaiah Adams. The center will be Alex Philstrom. The right guard is Zai Chrysler. Right tackle is Alex Pelzuski. The fourth wide receiver will be Pat Bryant. Flanker is Isaiah Williams. The quarterback is Tommy DeVito. Tommy DeVito, who you might know as the current Giants quarterback. And uh, New York Giants, that is, and halfback Chase Brown. So uh, we, yeah, we're in a passing mode here. I am. I'm just going to start off with a long. I'm going to go long to high tower. Let's do it. Let's see if we can do that. Tommy DeVito hits the man in stride, and he's down at the 50 yard line. That was a nice bomb by, by our man. So let me uh, let me bring up the um, let me bring up the running stat thing. Uh, so let's go reports view. Um, let's see. Uh, so far today, let's do the so far today. So there you go. You've got Tommy DeVito, and let's put it over here. DeVito so far is one for one for twenty eight yards, and we just saw that twenty eight yard pass. Let's go look in pass to the halfback Brown. And is that complete? And uh, yeah, it is. Four yard pickup. DeVito, man, two for two, 32 yards. Um, I'm going to go, let's go off tackle with Brown. Just to throw them a little bit of a curve here. Woo, woo, he broke right up the middle. He might have gotten a first down. And he did. He did. So, Illinois, we're moving the ball here. Um, let's, I'm, I'm going to try another long one. Let's go long to Washington. I mean, why not? DeVito is DeVito, man. I mean, he's, he was not even bad with the Giants in a couple of games. And he hits this man again for a touchdown pass. DeVito is amazing here. All right. They made DeVito probably a little too good. <laughs> Somebody call Strat because uh, DeVito is a little too good here. So uh, we'll continue. And DeVito is 3 of 3, 72 yards and a touchdown. I mean, I don't know how you can top that. We're going to do the kick. We're going to do the extra point. And that is going to be good. And Indiana, er, and uh, well, we're beating Indiana seven nothing, seven nothing. Illinois, all right, way to go. We're going to kick off. This is the Big Ten of the Big Ten. I mean, these two teams were they were Big, big Ten through and through. Like teams like Maryland, you know, I don't really call them Big Ten, but this is a Midwest matchup like you never saw. All right, so let's go. Um, yeah, let's. I'm just gonna go. I'm gonna start out balanced. I always start off balanced to see what a team is gonna do, and they decide to run the ball, and 
that dude is just getting some serious yards. So I would make the inference after one play that their strong suit is running the ball. Um, let's go 3-4 and focus on the run. And now they're going to pass. But it's incomplete. I'll bet you he's going to run right here. I would just, I would stake the house on it. So we're going to go 3-4. And we're going to look for the run. And he does run, and I got him in the backfield. So we, we caused him to lose some yards. So he's going to have a third and 13 from his own 46. Now he's got a pass. And we will look for the pass. And we did stop him. So I expect him to punt. I fully expect him to punt on this. Can't kick a field goal from there. That's a little too long away, especially for a college kicker. So they are going to punt. And we'll put in the punt return. Next time they're on offense, I'll try to remember to go over their offense and our defense. They do a coffin corner, which is not that much of a coffin for us. Fifth, I mean the 15-yard line, okay, but... Um, so, let's go flat pass to the halfback Brown. Oh, it's incomplete. That's a first incompletion for DeVito. All right, let's go short, medium pass to Hightower. And Hightower catches it for a first down and 11 yards on that. So DeVito, man, 4 of 5 today, 83 yards and a touchdown. Um... And Hightower has two receptions for 39 yards. I'm going to go look-in pass to the wide receiver, Washington. Ooh, incomplete. DeVito just misses two guys right between them. 10-17 left in the first quarter with us winning one nothing Illinois over Indiana. Um... Let's go. This is second and ten. I'm gonna go with I'm gonna go out of the pro set and we're gonna go off tackle with the fullback. And he's gonna get some yards, baby. So we've got a third and one coming up. I think he was completely fooled on that. Third and one. Uh, all right. Let's go line buck with the halfback. And he's going to get the first down. That's all I needed. It was only a yard, maybe two. Yeah, two yards, but that's all we needed. So we've got it. First down. It is first and ten uh, at the Illinois 37 for us. <clears throat> but we're moving. Let me try another long pass. DeVito is good at those. Let's go long to Hightower. Indiana isn't really uh, great on the coverage. They are not great on the coverage. <laughs> oh my God, this is like taking candy from a baby, although it is Indiana. So, you know, there's that. But DeVito, man, 5 of 7 for 111 yards and a touchdown. And we have a first and 10 at the Indiana 35. I'm going to go back out of the pro set. And let's go line buck with the fullback. I mean, he can't. Oh, there's a penalty. Penalty. Maybe on us, too. So we've got a first and 20 at the Indiana 45. Well, now you forced my hand. I'm going to have to go short to the wide receiver. 
Ooh, they're going to sack him. They're going to sack DeVito. This is the first time DeVito's had some problems. A 12-yard loss on that one. Well, you know we're going to go to his uh, bread and butter. We're going to go long to the flanker. And he had to do the outlet, and it going. he's going to miss him. You could tell he was going to miss him on that one. So, DeVito, 5 of 8, 111 yards and a touchdown. We're going to, what is this? Well, I guess we're locked in. Um, I'm going to go short, short, medium. I thought it was fourth down. No, it's third and 32. Third and 32, and we're going short pass. But, you know, hey, let's see what happens. That is just way incomplete. So there wasn't even... That was never going to happen. I was expecting to punt, or otherwise I would have put in the long pass. So we are going to punt. We're not going to fake punt. We're not going to do any of that. And so, you know, who out there misses college football? I mean, I'm already missing college football. We've still got the pros. We've got the NFL playoffs. But, uh... Yeah, definitely missing college football. All right, so let's go over the Indiana offense. They have Cam Camper at um, flanker. They have tight end A.J. Barner, right tackle Parker Hanna, right guard Tim Weaver, center Zach Carpenter, left guard Mike Caddick, left tackle Luke Haggard, Split end Emery Simmons, wide receiver DJ Matthews Jr. The quarterback is Connor Bazelek, and the fullback is Josh Henderson. Defensively, we have left end Keith Rudolph Jr., nose tackle Kelvin Avery, right tackle Jazar Newton, left linebacker Seth Coleman. Middle linebacker, Isaac D'Arcangelo. Right linebacker, Alec Bryant. Left cornerback, Devon Witherspoon. Strong safety, Sidney Brown. Free safety, J uh, Jartavius Martin. Right cornerback, Tavian Nicholson. And first defensive back, Matthew Bailey. So we're, I guess we'll set up to look for the pass, and he is passing. Good. And that's incomplete. And Bazelak has an incomplete pass there. He is one of three today for seven yards. Let's take a look at Bazelak's stats. Pass attempts, he was a 55.2% completion and a 2.3 interception rate for and for a college quarterback that isn't really all that great. We're going to put in the pass defense again. And they do pass and they get 7 yards out of that. But 6 yards. But they that does bring up a third and four. And I think they probably still got a pass on that, so I'm going to put in the pass defense. They are going to pass. And that is way incomplete. That was to nobody in particular right there. Cam Camper. Not uh, not even close. And so they have to punt from deep in their own territory. We're going to put in the punt return. I'm not going to try to, you know, I'm not going to force anything here. No reason to do that. I am going to try to catch it and run with it and we do and there's nothing nothing there 41 yard punt and a no yard return and we have a first and 10 at the Illinois 37 with 507 left in the first quarter I'm gonna go long again long to Hightower I mean Indiana is terrible at covering this <laughs> so and oh ooh, off his fingertips it looks like 
That was just incomplete. So we are going to go short to the flanker that on this play. Oh, there's a uh, uh oh, there's a flag, and Devito's out on the run. Nice run by Devito, though. He got three yards. Let's see. Oh, I'm going to accept that penalty. Hell yeah. All right, so we got a first and ten at the Indiana forty-five. Let's go. Let's let's throw him a curveball again and go off tackle with Brown. Ooh, Brown is hit at the line. No yards on that. The big zero-yard pickup. So we are going to on second and ten. We're going to go back to the pass. Let's go back to the long. Let's go long to Washington. Again, Indiana looks a little shaky on that, but DeVito's out on the run. They forced him out of the pocket, and he uh, only got a few yards. One yard, as a matter of fact, is all he got. So the Indiana defense looks like it wants to rise to the occasion. There's a third and nine coming up here. I'm going to go flat to the wide receiver. No, let's go flat to the halfback. And that is going to be a first down. Just barely a first down. Nice uh, nice reception there by Chase Brown. And we have a first and 10 at the Indiana 35. Let's Now let's air it out. Let's go long to Brian. DeVito 6 of 11 today for 121 yards. And he does an outlet pass. So he does hit his man and get a first down. Nice. We're moving the ball, moving the ball. So we have a first and 10 at the Indiana 23. I'm going to go short to the flanker Williams. DeVito can do no wrong. And that's going to hit him. Yep, first down there. DeVito is having an incredible day. I mean, I know this is Indiana, but he's 8 of 13, 145 yards and a touchdown. We're going to go to the we're going to go to the pro set and we're going to go line buck with a fullback. And he runs behind a blocker and gets some good yards, 5 or 6 there. Yeah, 6 yards. Nice. And I am going to go back to the pro set, and we're going to go line buck with the halfback, Brown. Ooh, ooh, they stop him at the line. Zero yard pickup there. This is going to be tough. What do you do here? We got a third and goal. Um, yeah, you put in that, you put in the short pass, you go to Bryant. Let's see if we can hit Brian in the end zone. Oh, they're going to sack DeVito. That guy came. He was like he shot out of a cannon. Yeah, Dason McCullough. He dropped him. He dropped him big time. So we have to kick a field goal, and we will. We should make it and put ourselves up 10 nothing as the first quarter is quickly coming to an end and uh, yeah it is we're kicking off the start of the second quarter here up 10 nothing Illinois over Indiana and look at this return man they had a great return on that they're gonna be first and 10 at their own 40 I'm going to look for the run, though, out of the uh, pass defense. Oh, they passed, though. Oh, did, we didn't pick that off? Come on. All right, well, um, now we're going to second and 10 at the 40. I'm going to put in the 3-4, and we're going to look for the run. And he does run. 
And we do get him after a zero yard gain, probably. Yep, dropped after zero yards. Not a very good Indiana team. Um, so we're going to say you're going to try to pass. Because, I mean, what other... Oh, there's a penalty on the play. Hopefully it's not on us. Well, they stopped the play. So it might be on them. No, it's on us. Oh, wait. No, it was on them. So they've got a 4th and 20. They're going to punt. Yeah. I am going to do the punt return. They're punting from uh, somewhat... Uh, somewhat deep, I mean, because they had the penalty that backed them up. We are going to try to return the ball. And we have good field position. We're going to be at the 43 for this. 10-yard return on that. Um, hmm, hmm, hmm. What do you do here? <laughs> Let's go short to the wide receiver, Brian. And uh, he's looking. DeVito's looking. And he's going to hit his man. Like seven yards for on that one. Six yards. I guess he had to take an outlet guy there because it's only six yards. All right. right, let's. Uh, uh, I'm going to go long here. Long to the wide receiver. And no, oh no, just a little over his head. DeVito, come on, DeVito. <laughs> All right, so uh, DeVito on the day is 9 of 15, 151 yards and a touchdown. Um, we've got a third and four, though. Out of this formation, I'm going to go off tackle with Brown. They should not be expecting that at all, and they're not, and we get the first down. So we keep the chains moving. We're in Indiana territory now. And we have a uh, first and 10 at the Indiana 45. Let's go long to the wide receiver. And that is a not a good pass. It was behind him. That one was behind him. Usually DeVito is overthrowing these guys. But in that particular instance, he underthrew him. Second and 10 at the 45, I'm going to do a short pass to the flanker, Williams. Let's go short to Williams, see if that can get us anything. It does get us a first down. How, you know, anybody out there for a first down? I am. So it's a 10-yard pickup. There's 11.53 left in the half. As we are moving the ball through Indiana territory, it is a first and 10 for us at 35. Got to get a little closer, I think, probably for our kicker. Let's do a short pass to Scott, the wide receiver Scott. And that is a beautiful pass, and he hits him in stride and gets 13 yards out of that. 12 yards. All right, 12. We'll take it. So we got a first and 10 at the 23. And out of this formation again, I'm going to go off tackle with Brown. And he runs right through a guy. He ran right over the linebacker and got it touched. <laughs> oh, boy. The fix is on, people. So <laughs> it's a 23-yard run for Brown. And uh, Brown today has six runs for 37 yards, a 6.2-yard average, and a touchdown. And we're going to do the extra point here. And we are smoking Indiana 17 nothing. And again, I understand it's Indiana, but man, this is a classic. It's a classic Big Ten matchup. So we're kicking off here. 10.46 left in the half. And again, they get a great return. Unbelievable, this kick returner. We got to stop him. That's the guy we got to stop, not their quarterback. Their quarterback, Basilek, that guy is the least of our worries. All right, we're gonna, let's try a safety blitz. I mean, we're playing with house money here. Ooh, they run the ball. And they're going to run it right down our throats and for a touchdown. No, they're not. We got them. But that was a big gain. 
All right, I got to stop getting careless here. Um, Sydney Brown made the tackle on that. We have it. They have a first and ten at our thirty-seven. So let's let's go into pass defense, and they are passing, and that is again to nobody in particular. Bazelak is uh, not the most accurate of passers. Uh, I, you know what? I'm going to go back to the 3-4. We're going to go to a run. Because, I mean, he's got to be seeing that if you're not going to do anything, he's not going to make a living with Bazelak passing. And we do stop the running back, but he gets six yards. Six yards when we were looking for it. Uh, third and four, you know what? I'm going to go... I'm going to go with a 4-3, and we're going to look for the run because I don't think he's going to pass. I'm daring him to pass, and we stopped him. Stopped him cold. Let's see if he tries to kick a field goal because I don't think that that's a given right there. He is going to try to kick a field goal. All right, uh, we're, we're going to go kick block. And he's going to miss that bad boy. I knew this is a college kicker, man. He ain't going to make that. <clears throat> so uh, we have a first and 10 at our 30. Let me launch it. Let's launch it. You know that's what we're going to do. We're going to launch to Washington. No wonder the Giants were so high on DeVito, man. The guy is great. Now that one, that one got knocked down by the coverage. All right, uh, let's go flat pass to the halfback Brown. And Brown catches it, and he's going to get a first down and a little more, a couple more. So he got a 12-yard gain on that. So DeVito today is 12 of 20, 185 yards and a touchdown. Let's try, let's stay with the high percentage passes. Let's go flat to the split end. And it's incomplete. High percentage pass. See, DeVito wants to launch it. He wants to go long again. I got to rein him in. All right, they've got a sec, we've got a second and 10. Let's go look in to the wide receiver. And that is caught, and for like six or seven yards. Five yards, just five yards. Wow. All right, so we got a third and five. Um, out of that formation, I'm going to go off tackle with the halfback, Brown. Oh, he just escaped, barely. All right, we've got, you know what, we got a decision here because he gets four yards. Or three yards. I've got a third and two coming up. Um, I am going to go out of the pro set. And I'm going to go line buck with the fullback to try to get this yardage. And he does get the yardage and he gets a little more. <laughs> oh boy. Now this is, the, this is a fun type of game to play. So anyway, we've got a first and 10 at the Indiana 43. Now we can launch it. Now, DeVito, you can launch it to Morris, and let's see what he can do. Oh, DeVito had to run out of the pocket, and he got sacked. That was a uh, loss of a yard. Let's go short to Bryant. And that is going to be almost a first down. We got not, we got like 10 yards on that. Yep, 10 yards. 10-yard 10 pickup. So we're going to have third and one. And you know what we're doing. We're going line buck with Brown. And he does get the first down and some more. And we're giving all this love to uh, to uh, uh, DeVito, but Brown today has eight runs for 47 yards, a 5.9-yard average, and a touchdown. Um, 
We have first and 10 at the Indiana 27. Don't want to mess that up. I'm going to go short to Brian. And he does. He hits him out by the sidelines. 347 is left in the half. And we have a first, uh, second and three at the 20. Let's go line buck with Brown. We're working Brown here, but he's loving it. And he gets the first down for us. And I'm going to let you know that uh, if this game becomes like what it looks like, a blowout, I'm going to uh, skip the third quarter and we'll just go right to the fourth quarter so that the uh, video isn't quite as long and you can you know, get a, get a good feel for what happened. We're going to go short to the flanker. Short to the flanker with DeVito. And that, ooh, it's incomplete. DeVito's so used to those long passes that, uh, you know, just didn't work for him. So he's 15 of 25 today, 207 yards. Uh, we have a second and 10. Let's go off tackle with Brown. Let's see what that can do. And that, ooh, he fumbled, but we've got a guy that can recover it. Um, I'm just going to fall on the ball. But there's a penalty also on the play. Four-yard pickup. Let's see who the penalty's on. Oh, I'm going to accept the penalty. <coughs> we got a first and goal to six. Let's go out of the pro set and go line buck with the fullback love. And he's going to get a touchdown. So that's it's going to make it 24. See, this is why I'm going to skip the third quarter. It's going to make it 24 nothing. And there is a penalty on the kick. So we have to kick from a little further back. We'll do that. That's fine. I don't know why they didn't assess that on the uh, kickoff. That probably would have been a better idea for them. But uh, we do make it. And it's 24 nothing as we kick off to Indiana. And they're going to take it for a touchback. And we're going to look for the pass because time is running down here. There's only a minute 45. They run the ball, though, and it's a hell of a run, too. He gets 14 yards, but still, you know, time is working against them. Um, I know they're probably calling their timeouts, but still. Let's go. All right, let's look for the run. There is a penalty, and they pass it, and they're going to get to their first down and out of bounds, but let's see if there was a penalty on the play on them. No. So they have a first and 10 at the Illinois 35. Got to start looking for the pass. We've got to get serious here. And they run the ball, and they run the ball really well for a touch. No, not a touchdown. We caught them at the last minute at the five-yard line, tracked them down. Um, I am going to go out of the 4-3, and we're going to look for the run. He's going to pass it, though. He wants to pass it in. And he does for a touchdown. So Indiana does manage to score. Uh, but they leave, you know, you're leaving, you're leaving Tommy DeVito a little too much time. Let's go kick block, though. And we do not block it, so it is 
with 52 seconds, 50 some kind of seconds left. And they're going to kick off to us with 52 seconds left in the half. And Indiana will get the ball at the start of the second half. Uh, I'm going to run with the ball because we want to get as many yards as we can for DeVito and his long pass. Wait, I just got to beat the punter? Ooh, but the punter makes the play at the uh, 41-yard line. So we have 45 seconds left. Let's go long. Let's launch this bad boy to the flanker. I didn't even call a timeout. Probably should have because this is just going to be a get out of bounds kind of a play. And he doesn't even get out of bounds. So I do need to take a timeout for sure. Um, yeah, I'm going to call a timeout. 37 seconds left. That's the formation. Let's go long. Long to the flanker. We're launching to the flanker. And it's going to be a touchdown, Illinois. And we answer with our own touchdown. I'm going to trust that we did not give him enough time to score another touchdown before the half gets out. And we are going to kick the extra point. And that's going to make it 31-7. That should be your halftime score, but let's see what Indiana can pull out of their butt here with 22 seconds left. They're, now, they got a good return team. Those boys can return the kicks for sure. And this is no exception. He's got the ball at the 36-yard line. But um, I am going to just put in the pass defense. And he runs the ball kind of amazingly. I mean, he had to know that he's... I mean, he's got to be running out. Well, no, he's got his timeouts, but still. There's... Uh, there's only eight seconds left. You gotta pass, to. I mean, I know that your running game is what you're hanging your hat on, but you're gonna have to pass. And that is incomplete. No surprise there. They were trying to hit Donovan McCulley. One second left. We're gonna go uh, pass. And that is going to be seriously off target, and uh, that is how your half is going to end. And uh, so uh, let's take a look at the box score so far. Um, Tommy DeVito is 17 of 27, 248 yards, two touchdowns, no interceptions. And Bazelak is 4 of 11 for 29 yards, one touchdown. Um, Chase Brown has 10 rushes for 55 yards and a touchdown. DeVito has 5 for negative 15. Reggie Love the third has 4 rushes for 28 yards. For them, Henderson has 4 rushes for 61 yards. Sean Shivers has 3 for 4. And Jalen Lucas has 2 rushes for 44 yards. So um, I am going to do the kickoff, and then after the kickoff, when they take the ball, we are going to fast forward to the start of the fourth quarter, or as close to the start of the fourth quarter as I can get, because the score is 31-7, and we are kicking Indiana's ass right into the dirt. So uh, let's go game. Um Auto play until um, 15 minutes left in the game. And it's uh, 30, it's, what is it? 
It's 38-19. And now I kind of wish I could go back and see how that all happened. But it's still 38-19. And we are going to punt the ball uh, with only one, what, what is it? One quarter, yeah. Most of a, one quarter left. So they are making it, I mean, I don't want to even really say they're making it competitive. They're still down by um, uh, 21 points, three touchdowns. So they have a first and 10 at their 28. I am going to, I'm going to look for the run out of the passing formation. Oh, they are passing though. And he caught it. So now all of a sudden they want to get serious. All right, so we're going to look for the pass. And they are passing. Luckily they're passing now. And that is incomplete. Now again, I have a suspicion that they're going to run the ball here. 13-32 left in the game. Just call me crazy. I'm going to say that they're going to run. And they do. And we do stop them pretty quickly there. Three yard maybe. Three yard pickup. Four yards. So there is a third and six coming up. I'm going to look for the pass. And he is looking to pass the ball for sure. And it's incomplete. Now let's see what he does. Whether he goes for it or not. There's 1240 left in the game, but he's he's down by 21 points. Yeah, he's passing for sure. We're going to put in the pass defense. And he runs the ball. Well, he doesn't really. It really was kind of a pass behind the line. But we dropped him for nothing, and so we're going to take over right there. We've got a first and 10 at the Illinois 42. Let's go long. Let's go long to the half. Oh, no, not the halfback. Flanker. Let's go long to the flanker. And that is going to be overthrown. So DeVito is 19 of 32, 257 yards, three touchdowns, no interceptions. Let's go back to the short pass. To Bryant. Uh, I don't, yeah, we, it looks like the penalty's on us. We got a second and 15 at the 37. Let's go short stop, a short pass to the flanker. Short to the flank, and it's incomplete. DeVito. DeVito is letting us down here. All right, we got to go back to his favorite play, the long pass, the bomb. Let's go long to Bryant. And they are not, it, he just gets it off the fingertips. So we are going to punt for sure here. There is 11-11 left in the game, and we have a uh, three-touchdown lead. And they are going to do a fair catch right there. So first and 10 for Indiana at their 25. I'm going to put in the pass because they can run all day if they want. I mean, you know, you're not going to make up a three-touchdown deficit. Um including giving us the ball back after a score with, uh, with runs. And we stopped him quickly there. We weren't even looking for it, and we stopped him after zero yards. So 10.02 left in the game. We're going to put in the pass on a third and 10 call for Indiana at the 25. And that's seriously incomplete. Let's see, this deep in his end, let's see if he goes for it. Fourth and ten, no, they're going to punt. And I would have expected that because you're just giving it to us on, our, on your doorstep if you do that. 
I mean, you know, there's not much of a chance they're going to come back, but I am going to run, try to get some yards, and that is a nice run, too. Nice return there. So, 9.31 left. We got a first and 10 at the Indiana 47. Let's see if he can launch it to Bryant. And he can! <laughs> DeVito! DeVito rises to the occasion. I know the other coach would be like, you know, this dude is trying to run up the score. But, hey, that's, that's when the game is fun. So DeVito today is 20 of 35, 291 yards and three touchdown passes. And let's see if he can throw one into the end zone to the flanker. He can't. He misses the flanker. It's out in front of him a little too far. He let him a little too far on that. So we got a second and 10 at the 13-yard line. Let's go off tackle with Brown because they are not going to expect that at all. Oh, but they stop him. They stopped him right at the line and he got nothing. All right, we're going to have to go short. You're forcing me. You're forcing me to do something I don't want to do. I'm going to go short to the flanker. <laughs> but do I not really want to do that? Oh, it's intercepted. DeVito picked off for the first time today. That, but they needed to do that, you know. Still, DeVito, man, come on. DeVito, 20 of 37, 291 yards, three touchdowns, and an interception. I'm going to go with, with a linebacker blitz. Let's see what that does. It's not going to do anything. But it's incomplete because their quarterback is terrible. Uh, okay, second and ten. Let's just go with the uh, pass defense. They are passing. And they hit the man for an 11-yard pickup. So that time, Bazelak was on target. And we're going to put in the pass defense. There is, they have a first and 10 uh, at their 35 with seven minutes left in the game. And that is, again, he underthrew his receiver there. Intended for um, Cam Camper. So second and ten, we're going to put in the pass defense. And the woo -hoo, we weren't even looking for the run, and we got their guy in the backfield for a serious six-yard loss. Third and 16 for them. Definitely looking pass. And he does pass, and he throws it to nobody in particular. And, uh, I mean, he was looking for Camper again, but, you know, if you're looking for Camper, that was bad. Punt return for us. 38-19, Illinois beating Indiana. Battle of the Midwest, the Big Ten. And um, not much of a battle. We're going to run the ball, but it, we don't go anywhere with it. 43-yard kick, and we get the fire catch. Let's launch it. I don't know. What are we going to do here? Launch. And that is a 9-yard pickup. So he had to go to uh, an outlet receiver. The long pass, it, I guess, just wasn't there. We have a second and one. Um, yeah, and the pro set. He knows what I want to do. I'm going to go line buck with the full back. And he's going to get the first down. He just gets a little bit more than that, but that's all we needed. We just needed the first down to have a first down. So we've got a first and 10 at the Illinois 40. Now we're going to go launch it again to Bryant. Ooh, he's going to be sacked, and he's going to be sacked for a massive yardage loss there. 14-yard loss. 
DeVito, you can't let that happen, man. 21 of 38, 300 yards, three touchdowns, and an interception, and we have a second and 24. Let's try to work it back. Uh, yeah, let's go short to the halfback. Let's try to work it back a little at a time here. We've got a few downs to do that. Uh, but remains to be seen he overthrows his man on the short pass. Well, now you know third and 24 you're going long because you're not going to get the yardage you need on a... Uh, Short pass, so let's go long to Hightower. Hightower should beat his man. Let's hope he does. Looks like an outlet, though. The long pass just wasn't there, so DeVito had to take what he was given. Which is only seven yards, by the way. Well, we got a fourth and 17. We're going to punt. I mean, I, it would be fun to go for it and see if he can get 17 yards, but I'm not going to do that. 308 left in the game because I mean, you know, we would we would we'd win the game anyway. But they do a fair catch after a 38-yard punt, and we will, of course, put in the pass defense. And he runs the ball, and again, he's welcome to run the ball all day long. I'll give him five-yard chunks of uh, real estate all day long from now on. Um, we're gonna go with the uh, we're gonna go with the pass, and we get him. We get him in the backfield. Two-yard loss for them. Got a third and seven. I am definitely going to look for the pass. And that is incomplete. Now it remains to be seen again. What is he going to do? Only a minute 41 left in the game. I mean, he knows he lost the game. So he is going to punt. We'll put in the punt block just for fun. And we're not going to block it. And I will try to catch the ball and run with it, but he doesn't. He just takes the fair catch after a 45-yard punt with a minute 30 left, minute 22 left. Let's go long to the flanker. He thought I was going to do the victory formation. Come on, man. You know me better than that. I got Tommy DeVito. Tommy DeVito. <laughs> Yeah, the Indiana coach would not be happy with me. For sure he wouldn't. But, you know, we got to get DeVito all of his stats because, you know, once he hits the Giants, he's, like, mediocre. So DeVito today is 23 of 41, 384 yards, four touchdowns and an interception, and we are going to try the extra point. And it's good, so it's 45-19. Yeah, they just, just suffice it to say, Indiana thought we were just going to go victory formation, but you know, that's not me. <laughs> that's not in me. So uh, they return the ball, and they are going to again get a great return, maybe even a return for a touchdown. I'm glad I saw this. They're going to get a touchdown return on the kickoff, Indiana. So let's see if they try an onside kick. I mean, they got to go for two. I think you got to go for two, right? Yeah. Uh, no, they're going to kick it. So we're going to go kick block. And they make it, and it is 45 20. Well, we knew they had a good return team. And they are. They're just going to do a regular kickoff. Well, they know. There's a minute left, and we're ahead by quite a bit. I am going to run with the ball. And we get stopped at the 22 on the return. Uh, DeVito, let's see if he can go long. Let's see if he can do it again. 52 seconds left in the game. 
DeVito is going to get it off just out in front of the guy. And I won't even say that was off the fingertips. It was just out in front of him. So let's do it again. You can do it again. We're going to go long to Hightower. 45 seconds left. DeVito! But the, the coverage guy is closing and got him. All right. Uh, we're going to, I'm going to call a timeout. <laughs> the computer is like, all right, you're a, you're a dick. So <laughs> let's go long to the flanker. Oh, oh, they're going to sack him. Huh, I wanted to get some points. Come on, man. I want to get some points, DeVito. Um, 37 seconds left. I am going to call a timeout. So there's 30 seconds left. Let's go. Let's This time, let's go short to Williams. Try something a little bit more high percentage just to get us closer. And it's incomplete. All right, third and sixteen. Um, I am. I'm going to try another high percentage short to the Williams man. Oh, they sacked him. All right, you're forcing my hand. You know that, right? Twenty-two seconds left. Um, I'm going to call a timeout. My last timeout. Fifteen seconds left. Oh no! Wait a minute. Oh dang it! You know what? I'm going to do the fake punt. Let's do the fake punt. And uh, you, you can't run it that far. Well, uh, no. Well, he can, but not far enough. All right, eight seconds left. We're going to look for the pass. And he does catch the ball. This probably will end the game, I'm going to guess, especially since we got him in bounds. We will look at the final stats, so stick around for that. Oh no, there's a second left. And he runs the ball. I mean, he knew. He knew. So game over. Let's <coughs> let's take a look at the statistics for this game. Final score 45-26. DeVito was 24 of 44, 421 yards, four touchdowns and an interception. And Basilek was a surprising, he had a 110 rating for this game. He was 14 of 31, 161 yards and two touchdowns with no interceptions. Uh, Chase Brown had 18 rushes for 72 yards and a touchdown. Tommy DeVito had nine rushes for negative 39 yards and three um, for a three yard long. Reggie Love uh, the third got five rushes for 31 yards and Robertson had one rush for nine. For them, Josh Henderson had 11 rushes for 104. Shivers had, <coughs> had 9 for 6. And Lucas rushed 4 times for 36 yards. I'll let you look at the receiving stats there. Um, uh, Williams had a great day. 6 receptions, 147 yards. And Long was 77 and he had 2 touchdowns. So that is going to be it for me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.